Hey you guys and welcome to another movie haul Monday where there is going to be a movie haul every Monday while supplies last which should be for a little bit um and then hopefully there will be I want to go to Black Friday and buy lots and lots and lots but I'm trying to control myself this year hopefully because I, I thought I'd scale back and just wait for the next year but let's get started the first one I have to show you is Freedom Riders and this one features um Hillary Swank and Patrick Dempsey and it's based off a true story and this is how the disc looks and it's about this teacher who goes to this dropped into the free fire zone of a school torn by violence and racial tensions and she kind of has them write their own stories and I guess they kind of get really into it and it's one of those feel good movies and I really enjoyed it when from what I remember watching it when I first watched it it's been a long time since it like first came out and I know at one point I owned the book but not anymore someone stole it yeah weird to steal a thing to steal the next thing I have to show you is fireflies in the garden for one family a chance to start again uh this stars Ryan Reynolds Willem Dafoe Emily Watson Carrie Ann Moss, Hayden Panettiere, and Julia Roberts. And it's about like this one guy kind of comes back from to see his mother graduate and I guess something happens to her. And then all these family secrets kind of get released and stuff. And I think at one point he had written a book and that kind of creates tension in the family too, I guess. So we go back to old and young, I believe. So I'm looking forward to actually watching this because I've been wanting to watch it for a long time. The next one that I have is Northern Lands. And this is another movie based off of a Nora Roberts novel, which I loved. And this one stars Leanne Rimes and Eddie Sibring. And it follows this guy, who Nate Burns, who accepts the job as a chief of police in this remote Alaskan town. And he's like from Baltimore. And he meets her. Uh, she's a bush pilot with her own demons. And it kind of all comes to a head when the person, the one, the, her father, who she thought abandoned her and her mother, turn up dead. And he has to investigate and things, you know, secrets come out. And I'm really looking forward to rewatching it because I really loved it um the next one is it's kind of a funny story and this one is also based off a book and it stars Gear Gilchrist <laughs> Emma Roberts and Zach Galifianakis and it's about this boy who I think he checks himself into a mental health clinic for some time out and he meets an unlikely mentor it's just kind of like a funny coming of age story thing I remember I got it at Redbox once and it was fun so I decided to get it and I also got the book but I haven't read it yet sad I know and then the last movie that I got is what I'm really excited for and it is Joan of Arc starring Lily Selbieski some of you guys might remember her from like the glass house and joyride and stuff but I really uh, enjoy her and this is based off a uh, real uh history and it's about this girl who's like a legendary warrior who like at 17 led one of the greatest campaigns for freedom ever so she is born to a peasant french family joan and she thinks she and she hears a voice uh saints calling out to her to unite the united kingdom and she kind of convinces the king um about that and she leads his army in a huge battle and the thing is everyone kind of i guess in history dispute what kind of happened only to the fact that she'd heard saints uh, and talking to her some people thought she was kind of schizophrenic and you know there's a debate about that but i really enjoyed this movie so i decided to go ahead and get it and you know history it's fun to watch and yet sometimes not to read about but um those are all the movies that i have to show you today so you guys let me know down below which movies have you guys seen before whether you liked me hated them or are, are there any movies that you would uh, recommend to me that i need to see and i will see you guys later so, bye